Hello and welcome to our channel Nutramite where we provide informative videos regarding health and lifestyle. Please like, share and subscribe to the channel and click on the bell icon for important notification and videos. Lessons from Cristiano Ronaldo that can change your life. Cristiano Ronaldo is a Portuguese professional footballer who plays as a forward for Serie Club, Juventus and captains for the Portugal national team. He is the fifth child in his family. He was born in a not so economically stable family. His father was an addict to drinks. The place where his resident resides was never a healthy environment to survive. The place was not good in literal terms. It's difficult to have a healthy mind and growing thinking. He had his own struggles and one can learn a lot of lessons from this. This will help you improve your lifestyle, procrastination and laziness. The struggle with a positive attitude. During his childhood days, he faced many difficult times. The struggle kept on pushing him forward. This was not because he had a dream. It happened because he was never ready to give up. He always kept learning from his own life lessons. That's a positive attitude towards any situation. Despite being in many troubles, he never let the self-belief fail. With this, we got our first lesson. Never give up on yourself, on your dreams, on your belief, no matter how hard the situation is. The struggle with family. Cristiano was the fifth in his family. He has a big family. It was very challenging for his mother to handle all the expenses on her own as his father was an alcoholic and didn't have a fixed job. To meet the ends of the family, he did odd jobs. On the other hand, his mother used to manage her part by doing gardening. So he had enough reasons to start doubting his potential, but he didn't. He faced struggled but didn't doubted his parents' efforts and his potential. I think here we got our second lesson. Never give up on your potential. No matter how bad situations are testing you, you have to maintain the balance between mental chaos and your hard work. Struggle with the studies and sports. Ronaldo was never a bright student. He was never been extraordinary in studies and grades as he is in the field. He was very excellent in football. Once he said that during a class at school, he throws the chair at the class coordinator to take a stand for himself and to prove his extraordinary confidence. This was also a part of his struggle. He knows when to take stand and for what. Ronaldo got a lot of insightful advice from his dad despite being from a poor background and alcoholism. He never forgot what lessons his father taught him. This shaped up how he behaved like a mature adult. Here we got our third lesson on maintaining our calm and when to take action. When it's about your self-respect, you have to take a stand. But it's about maintaining your calm over any situation. That's what makes you a big person rather than engaging in silly controversies and losing your energy. Struggle in making the world believe in you. Ronaldo was not always as popular as he is now. His geniuses were not known to the world in his early days. His name has come into heights of famous when he started playing in reputed platforms. Once at the club level, Ronaldo underwent bullying from his co-players and opponents. Being a strong person both mentally and physically, he managed to overcome all these issues easily. Yet, he is striving for excellence in everything he does. We got fifth one from this lessons, that is, have patience with life. Don't rush behind anything in life. Keep working towards it with your all heart, soul and body. It will come to you one day. It is not the footballing skills that make him a great person but his off-sports character that makes him an ultra-legend. First, Cristiano declared not to drink or smoke. He saw his dad's addiction to alcohol and smoking, so he decided to consider this to not get into such activities. Even after many allegations were filed against him, stating and showing pictures of his of doing the same, 
but later on the allegations found out to be fake second there were questions on his hairstyle also but later on it was revealed that his hairstyle was a sign of respect to one of his fans who was recovering from chemotherapy and loss of hair due to treatment during the 2014 world cup third when he was asked for raising funds for a cancer patient he not only gave signed boots and jersey but also wrote a personal check for full hospital expenses in treatment for the child he also visited the child in the hospital several times fourth he actively supports four organizations so we all know such a great character cristiano ronaldo is so we all should get motivated from his life lessons thank you thank you please like share and subscribe to the channel click on the bell icon for important notifications and videos